Okay, it's a wet day outside today. It's Tuesday morning and I'm going to do some of the Two Moors Way. I'm starting at the village of Yeomill and out, I'm in the car park of the Anstey Village Hall. So Climb Southwest do an event from the south coast, Wembury, south coast of Devon, right up to the north coast of Devon, finishing in Lynmouth. And this is just a small section of the route that I'm going to run today. Anstey Village Hall is the third cut-off point and major checkpoint where food and rest is provided. So let's get going. You can see the Village Hall behind me, it's quite a distinctive clock tower on it. And that's the third checkpoint. Okay, I've got my trusty running partner with me, there's Jet. There's the Village Hall. And we're heading out. And that would be the final section, the final marathon, ultra marathon section of the Two Moors Way. I'm not going that far today, today I'm going to aim for Hawk Ridge. So I'm going to go up through West Anstey, over Anstey Common, and to Hawk Ridge. Quick pause for my dog there. So let's go. Heading out of the mill now. Just come up the hill slightly, come to a bit of staggered crossroads. Look for the sign on the telegraph pole. Head right. Oh. Uphill. Uphill all the way to the top of West Anstey Common. Not even at West Anstey yet. here and wonder if I've missed the turning. I'm good at getting lost, but no, there's the sign coming off the lane now. Two more's way. Let's do it. I'm getting really warm now. It's not actually raining, so I need to derobe a bit. Hat and coat off, I think. Yeah, it pretty much all goes into my little backpack, which is nice and light. waiting for me. Okay, that's better. Okay, matching lippy. <laughs> With the top. Right, feeling a bit cooler. Let's go. It's not too muddy considering the rain we've had the last few days. So you're coming to the end of the trail, the gate up there, this particular bit of trail that is. So I'm approaching West Anstey just over this hill. Just before we go up and through the gate, I just want to show you this amazing countryside. Look at that. North Devon. Beautiful. Let's go on over to West Anstey now. Okay, cows. Me and cows don't get on. My path is down here. So I'm going to run like hell for leather. And I'm going to hopefully stay out of their view. But you can hear on the left, on the other side of that hedge, those ones are quite agitated. Well, you know, vocal. Those ones are quite vocal. So, I'm going to run. I made it safe. We're through West Anstey now, coming up, up the hill toward Anstey Common. This is the last bit of hill now before I get to the top. Looking forward to being on the open moor. So I'm walking this uphill. I usually walk the uphills, Not, nothing special about today. I'll do a little bit of running, but I save my legs for the flats and the downhills on longer distances. Otherwise I'd burn myself out. 
still leading the way. Plenty of legs left in her yet. Oh, finally, did I say 10 minutes ago, nearly at the top. <laughs> now I'm nearly at the top. That line of trees on the left is the start of the moor. So just before we get there, here's the views down over the countryside, looking west towards Barnstable. As the common, here we are on the moor. There she goes, a bit of freedom, no sheep around, so good to go. Just gotta watch out for ponies as well though. So, still on the two moors way, you go up to the right, over the top, and down into the valley just below Hawk Ridge. Hey darling, can I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, wanna see it now Pack our bags and get in that car Leave a little note and we'll drive real far Let's get out, we can leave this city Let's drive to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty There's a gate up near that tree in the left corner there, left of the house. Now in Hawkridge, when you get up here, it's easy to miss this little sign, but it's right next to the letterbox. The sign, oh, really cool. So you go left up there. Don't be fooled by the side of the tar steps straight on. It will take you to tar steps, but that's not the two miles away. Two miles away goes up here. There's a house on the right. Two more way goes through the heart of the garden, which is fenced off and well signed. So that's us. So 
that is us at Hawkridge. And we're gonna head back now. See you back at the car. Okay, Jed, you ready? Let's go, let's go. Well, back in the car. Um, I'm not sure of the distance. I stopped my wash at some point, paused it to do some filming and forgot to switch it back on again. Oh. So it says 11 kilometers, but I think it's more like maybe 15 or 16. So I don't know, I'll know how far it is from Yeomill to Hawkridge when I get back and download it onto my computer. And then I'll know by doubling it how far we went. So I will let you know later.